All right, welcome back to another episode of NCAA Football 2006. Last one, we went up against Illinois, the Fighting Illini, and we smoked them. We smoked them 37 to 7. They did get the first touchdown of the game, but we came back with a vengeance and we took it to them. We won 37 to 7, 37 unanswered points. Our, our stars showed out. Brad Johnson had a great game. Reggie had a nice bounce back. Our fullback showed out. It was very nice. So we're now, before we hop into this next game, we're going to take a look and see if anything changed with our recruits. And it looked like it did. So it looked like Gooden, um, his interest level went up. It looked like Respris. Well, we didn't put anything up there, but his stayed the same. Woods, he went up. Uh, Rashad Johnson went down. That's because we didn't put any points on him. Uh, Riggs, uh, neutral. Ramirez went up. Krieg went down. We didn't really put much on him. And Blackstock was neutral as well. Okay, so... And some people... And these two took uh, Rutgers off our list. That's okay. So... But this good end, guys, let's take a look at him. We are now at the top of his uh, his leader or, you know, interest level. So that's good. He Todd Gooden from Maryland, A plus field awareness. I mean, 670 squat, four star player. I would really like to get this guy. Um, Respiris, we're like at the bottom. I still feel like we're not going to get him. So I'm probably still not going to. He wants to go to a more prestigious program. That's okay. That's okay, yeah. So I think. So we're still going to leave points on Woods as well. He's still. We're second on his. We're second on his. Uh, you know, interest level. And he's from New Jersey as well. So we'll leave points on him. But. I think we can take points off of Krieg. He's more of a blocking tight end anyway. We can take five points off of Krieg. Um, let's see here. Evan Riggs. What are you about? Uh, he's going. To, he has a visit to Notre Dame. I feel like we're not going to get him either. Ramirez, we could get him. We could get him. So, you know what? I'm going to take points off you. I'm going to put points on Ramirez. Uh, Blackstock. I kind of want, I kind of want Blackstock too from New Jersey. We could use a corner. He's really fast. We're going to put a decent amount of points on Blackstock here. And the quarterback, he went down our list. Surprised he went down considering we had a really good game. We are red shirting that quarterback though. So it's interesting. Um, we might, and he's only a three star too. You know, we can we can pass on him. Um, you know, we'll we'll put points, we'll put more points on Blackstock and Woods, and we'll let's see. Yeah, we'll put we'll put twenty five on these four players. These are the four players we're gonna target. Uh, for right now, hopefully we'll, we'll hopefully we'll end up getting yeah hopefully we'll end up getting these four players. Okay, so heading into this week against uh, Buffalo, I think we or Villanova rather, we should be able to beat them. Villanova is not really known for football. Um, I mean yeah, they're a D minus everywhere. This should be an easy win. It's our home opener though, so you know the Rutgers, the Scarlet Knights, the uh, the fans should be out. Um, at least we'll have our home support for this one, but I'm expecting it. This should be an easy one for us. We really should have no problems with this one, but yeah, we're going to hop in here. Game number three of year number one, Rutgers, Villanova. Let's get it done. All right. We are kicking off to start this game, man. Our, our stadium is looking pretty sad right now. I, I remember Rutgers having a nicer stadium than this when I went to school here. I don't even think we don't even have any, uh, we don't even have any color commentators for this game. It's so low. This game is so low on the totem pole in terms of, like, college games. There's not even a commentator here. There's literally, like, there's no play-by-play. -play. Oh, he fumbled. 
And we got the ball on the first play of the game. Okay. All right. I like it. I like it. Do your dance, young man. Do your dance. Yeah, this should be an easy game. Villanova, they're not really on our level, although we, they did make a nice play for loss there. All right, let's see if we can get the end zone here. Inception. Ooh, bad read, bad throw, and we get picked off. We turn it over right back. All right, Villanova's fighting in this one. All right, Villanova's got the ball now. Let's see if they answer back off that nice turnover, and they are going to get the first down, first first down of the game for Villanova. Maybe I came out a little too cocky, a little too confident in this one because, uh, you know, as of right now, Villanova looks like the better team. Although we are going to – oh, no, we're not. He stays on his feet somehow and they get another first down. What is going on? Back-to-back -back gains of 14 yards for Villanova, and they are now suddenly at midfield. Can't make tackles right now. All right, ball at the 44. Let's see if we can get a stop here, get the ball back. Another turnover would be nice, give our offense – Chance at redemption here. They're doing a toss back to the quarterback. Didn't really work, but it's still cool to see. And the quarterback is hurt. Hate to see that. He's not used to getting tackled like that, like a receiver. Backup's coming in. Let's see. Third and three from the 42. Let's see if we can force a, a stop, force a punt. Can we get to the quarterback? We do. Big sack there. I just realized that Villanova, they don't even have player names on their uh, their team. I forgot to, I forgot to generate n names for their roster. As of right now, it's they just got numbers on the back of their jerseys. All right, so we are going to start the ball here inside our own 20. All right, let's see if we can get some a little redemption here from that last drive. That was a risky throw. Yeah. All right, let's see if Reggie can get any yards here. Toss to the left. Oh, yeah, Reggie... Reggie's got a hole. Yeah, Reggie's... Oh, this guy, this guy might catch up. This guy might catch up. Is number 10 going to get to Reggie? Is he going to get there? No, he's not. And Reggie's going to take that one to the house. 84-yard touchdown run for Reggie Johnson. Yeah, I had a feeling, uh, you know, they wouldn't be able to keep up with our speed here. You know, Villanova, they, 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 they held in for a little bit, but they just don't have the speed to match up on offense. Uh... Reggie Johnson, 84 yards to the house, so we are on the board first. All right, so seven nothing lead here for the Scarlet Knights. I mean, I was, you know, we might not have started off the game too well, but this is a game we should win. So I'm not too surprised we're off to an early lead here. But remember, our goal here in year number one is to at least make a bowl game. So all these, any, all these wins are important. We need to get to at least six wins to get a bowl game, and our schedule will get. A little bit tougher when we start playing, you know, some of those other better programs in, our, in the Big East. All right, second and long. All right, they're going to throw it here. Intercepted. Herman with the pick, and he's going to take it for a pick six. Oh, I don't even know what he's doing. I don't know what that was, sell, sell he was, but we are now up four, or about to be a 14 nothing. Yeah, yeah, this is... Uh, we might not be the greatest program, but we're certainly a better program than Villanova at football. Yep, this is shaping up to be a blowout. Pretty much kind of how I expected it to. Um, I mean, the game didn't start exactly how I planned, but this is more or less what I expected. Ooh, can we get the sack? Oh, I missed. I missed him. All right. Still only got like two yards, though. Oh, and number five receiver injured his back on the play. Oh, he's holding his arm, though, so I don't know what's going on. They're running it here. Oh, can we get him in the backfield? Yep. All right. Third and long. Third and long here for Villanova. Oh, almost got the sack again. But we are going to, yep, force him short. They're going to have to punt. Okay, we can get a punt return, you think? Oh, yeah, we are. Yeah. Yeah, Villanova. <laughs> I feel bad, but Villanova, they just. This is almost like playing on rookie. I almost didn't get in the end zone there. This is almost like playing on rookie. Villanova's just, you know, they don't. Yeah, this is, uh. This is getting pretty ugly now. Good for us, but, you know. I, I didn't expect this to be that much competitive game. So, uh, from now on, I'm probably going to only show highlights of some big plays that happen instead of show every play like I usually do. So. 
yeah, we're, we'll keep this going, see how much points we can get. Oh, big sack, big sack. Third down now upcoming. Another, oh, we almost got, I wanted the other sack. No, they're going to get, no, my tackling is so bad. No, no, ah, uh, that was all me. Oh, another interception. That's going to be another pick six. Weber this time. He's going to take it the distance, and he scores it. Villanova had something going there, but ends the same. Another pick six for the Rutgers Scarlet Knights. Poor bat. Yeah, I'm sure this bag of quarterback wasn't expecting to play today. The receiver running back wasn't even looking. Weber takes it 65 yards to the house. 28-0 Rutgers. Ooh, what a spin move. What a what a play by number 22. Respect. Nice little carry there. Another sack. Another one. Poor poor backup quarterback number 17, man. He's taking some hits right now. He's taking some hits. Wow, what a what a dime there. Number 17 stays in the pocket in the face of pressure, throws a rope to 89, and Villanova's in, in the red zone. Oh, another sack, man. We are going to break the school record for sacks at this rate. All right, good for Villanova. They finally got on the board. They're not going to get shut out in this one. Booth. Oh, that's oh oh booth. Oh, that's another one. That's just too easy. It's too easy. Oh yeah. This is uh <laughs> probably the easiest game. And they're just getting hurt, man. I feel bad. I really do. I feel bad for them. Oh yeah, safety now. Oh boy. Alright. We're just we're gonna go we're gonna show some mercy. We're just gonna run the clock down for the rest of the half. Or at least try to. This is this is embarrassing. <laughs> All right, we are now underway here for the second half. Yeah, it's it's pretty bad here. Um, not really much of a fight, but we're gonna just try and run the clock down here in the second half. I'll show the Reggie, Reggie up the middle. That's gonna be another. I was I swear I was just trying to run the clock down. I was just trying to run some clock. I ran a HB dive or HB slam, and he takes it 72 yards. Reggie's got like over like almost 200 yards. I feel like already today. Wow. Yeah, the Villanova. They are uh, they are already ready to go back to Philadelphia or Pennsylvania, wherever wherever they're from. All right, I'm actually just realizing I don't think we completed a pass yet this game. Let's see if we can get a pass completion. Hey, we got one in the booth. All right. First completion of the day. Yeah, he's, he's one of seven. It's pretty bad. It's pretty terrible, actually. Reggie, another touchdown up the middle. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'm really trying not to embarrass them. I swear. This is, they're so bad. <laughs> Reggie. In the open field once again. And that's another touchdown. School record, 247 yards in a game. All right. I think that'll do it. I think we're going to just – I think we're just going to fast forward to the fourth quarter now. Or not the fourth quarter, the end of the game. I think, uh, I think this one's well, well out of reach. It's been well out of reach, I should say. So we've been pretty much in heavy prevent defense, just trying to keep the clock running. So Villanova might actually get a touchdown here. They are now at the goal line. And, yep, they are. Good for them. They finally, finally found the end zone, giving their school something to cheer about, something to look at the film later. They got a touchdown. All right.
Nice run by 22. All right, and that's going to do it. Rutgers wins the home opener. Final score of 58 to 10. I could have um, scored some more there at the end, but I, I, you know, I didn't want to run up the score and embarrass Villanova. You know, they they made the trip out here. I mean, it's not very far of a trip from Villanova to Rutgers, but you know what I mean. We they came here, and you know, I just wanted to get the game over with. It was pretty much a no contest. It was getting boring scoring all those touchdowns, anyways. But that should definitely help us with our recruits. Our recruits should you know be watching that and take note and be like, hey, you know what, Rutgers, they're two and one. They just beat up on Villanova. Maybe that's a a school I want to play for. Now, I don't expect Buffalo to be uh, any bit, well, maybe a little bit tougher, but I don't think Buffalo is going to be a t- uh, very challenging game either. I think we're really, when we play Pittsburgh, that's when it's going to be, you know, I think I think the Pittsburgh game is going to be pretty tough. They were ranked to start the year. They lost the first game. Don't know who they played, but then you also got to think we still have to play Louisville as well, and they are ranked in the top five, I believe. I think they were ranked like third, maybe. I don't remember. We'll have to see. But our schedule is going to get a little bit tougher. But I think we can get to the six wins. Again, that is our goal. We want to get the six wins so we can get the bowl game. West Virginia is also going to be a tough one. Yeah, there's we, we have tough games. Yeah, Louisville's ranked six. So these are Cincinnati. Yeah. Don't don't get me wrong. I mean, we're Buffalo is probably going to be a, another win. Three and one. But these games are going to get much tougher. All these games here are going to be very, very difficult. Uh, but I still think we could maybe squeak out uh, six wins and get to a bowl game. And then hopefully we get some good recruits. And then from those recruits, we'll hopefully we can build the program into a dynasty, hence the name of the game mode. But, yeah, pretty easy win. I was, you know, I said it from the beginning. I didn't think this was going to be much of a challenge. Uh, probably could have bump the difficulty up to Heisman. I think right now it's on All-American, which is like All-Pro, basically. Probably could have bumped that one up to Heisman. We still probably would have won, but yeah. Easy win. Next one, we'll play against Buffalo. Next episode, we'll take a look at the recruits as well and see you know, if there was any change in movement uh, for our recruits. Maybe we'll reallocate some of the points to some different players, but anyways, that's going to do it for this one. Until next time, catch y'all later.